Before I start, you think you'll be missed. You're nobody. Jump in. Jump now. Jump in front of the car. Go on. Go on. Stop. Hey guys, so this video is a little bit different than what we traditionally do. Uh, this video is for you. This video is for the silent ones. This video is for the ones sitting in the back waiting. This video is for the nobodies, the PTSDs, the veterans, the people that feel like they've lost everything. This video is for you. So we are doing a charity event for suicide prevention. Okay, we're, we're wanting to put an end to suicide. For the ones that feel like they don't have a voice in this world. The ones that feel like nobody cares for them. Nobody misses them. Nobody wants to interact with them for any reason. We do. You know, we love you all so much. Without you guys, we wouldn't be here. You know, we wouldn't be in the position that we're in. Making content for you to enjoy. You know, bringing you laughter through your day. You know, giving our all to make your day better. So... With that being said, there's myself, social, gaming, dream gaming, Frosty, um, Gun Down, Jack Utsu, I'm Just a Friend, um, Dorky Dad Gaming, and others that will be into this event and into this charity, and it's all for you. 100% of the proceeds that we get during our during our live, all the donations that we get, all go towards the charity. We are strictly doing this for you guys. Um, we'll show that you know, we'll we'll show the uh, where the link is in the description for you to donate yourself if you feel. Don't ever feel obligated that you have to, but it would be much much appreciated if you did. Um, you know, and we'll be able to be like, okay, so come the end of our stream, we'll sh we'll talk and we'll say, okay, you know, we gathered X amount for the charity support and this is exactly how much we're putting. So if we get $35 on the live, we're donating that 35 So it's all going to the same place, same charity, no hidden, no hidden things. And we're doing this for you. 100% for you. For the cause. Let's shut down. Suicide. And bring awareness. To it. We love you guys. Water right there. Water. 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 H2O. H2O. Oh no. Hey. 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 There's two. Oh no. water. Oh, that was fucking close. Oh, he's fucking dead. dead. Turn! Oh, 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 oh my god! Go now! Oh, go, 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 go! Fuck! Rick's cube! The wheels in the head go round and round. So they were allowed to jump off the damn ship, but you weren't allowed to die. If you do it, I'm gonna be forced to do it too. And then I will be forced it. to do it. Then what the fuck? Ah, uh, fuck this. Yo. 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 Yo, who touched the light? Yo. Yo. <laughs> who turned off the fucking light? If you guys want to see videos with face cam, let me know. Alright, so we got the cemetery gate padlock. Okay, so maybe that's like a picture. We should take a picture of that. That's very important, maybe. Alright. We use our skills out here and see if we can find anything remotely. It's locked. 
Okay, so looks like we need to go in this building first. Let's do that. All right, here we are inside of the police station. There's a flashlight. Oh, flashlight. D to store. Do I hold it or... Do I not pick it up? B to store. I'm pressing B. I guess I can't pick it up. Okay, well, I guess I can't pick it up. It looks like Payne's Creek map here. Old Creek Town, Mayor's Mansion, Payne's Creek Community Hospital. We're at the Sheriff Outpost, Post Office. Okay, it's pretty good, pretty good. All right, D-pad down. Oh, my controller is connected. The year is 1983. And this is the last chapter of Five Nights at Freddy's original story. We must once again defend ourselves against Freddy Fazbear, Chica, Bonnie, Oxy. But it says here that there are even worse things that lurk within the shadows. This time round we play as a child and their role is yet unknown. We must watch the doors and try to ward off any unwanted things that may try to venture into our closet or onto the bed behind us. The only thing we have to protect ourselves is a flashlight. It will scare things away that try creeping at the far end of the corridors. But we must be careful and listen because if something has crept too close to us, shining our light in its eyes really won't help and it will be our end. Now it sounds pretty terrifying as we're playing as a child and we've got these monstrous things that are stalking us in the night. Is it a dream? Is it not? I don't know. But let's have a look at these animatronics because trust me, they look horrifying. It's one. Okay. So we're just sitting at the end of our bed. So click here to run to the door. Uh, warning, listen carefully. If you hear breathing, hold the door shut. If you do not hear breathing, then use your flashlight. Oh. Alright. Okay. So if we hear breathing, we shut the door. Which, oh, okay, is shift. Okay, so shift to control are the only ones that I need on the um, on the keyboard, so that's good. Does our flashlight have uh, a life? Okay, this is going to be interesting. So, so so far, pretty quiet light. Um, you know, I've seen something demonic trying to spawn out of Fred there. So, I'm assuming I just keep looking back and forth at it stop it from doing whatever it is wanting to do but yeah so far nice quiet night which is good so no doubt well, as soon as i get to night two things are going to be terrifying um i've literally just been running back and forth from each door non-stop no breaks no breaks hey night one survived see easy 6 a.m we stayed up all night <laughs> Oh god, right, what's next? What are you going to show me now? Oh god, right, here we go. At least the flashlight doesn't have no battery. Um, because if it did... Hmm. <laughs> okay, I just... I went to that door and it just threw me straight back. So what happens when they get to the doors? Do I just look away from them? I think so. Hello? Nothing's there. I just ignore them when they're at the door. Anything down here? I, I can hear something else moving about, hunting around. Turn around there. No. Okay. What about this one? I keep saying. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, that is, that is terrifying. <gasps> I always said that, like, if I was gonna, like, get cancer or something, I'm definitely pulling a Walter White. Like, because if you're gonna die anyway, what's the point? Like, you're literally a free man. You're, you just, there's no prosecution for you because you're gonna die anyway. If the doctor tells me I'm 100% dead in three months, I'm going to live up those three months. I'm gonna do whatever the fuck comes to my mind. I'm gonna, I'm going to complete every intrusive thought I've ever thought of. Because why would- What the fuck happened oh, I socked Joe. you in the mouth. Fuck. <laughs> What a motherfucking Frank. 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 Frank.
Okay. <laughs> God. Ow. I tried to run out of the range of it. Damn it. Beware, I have the nunchucks, boy. <laughs> He's got Christ, the nunchucks. That's terrifying. He's got that's the nunchucks. That's terrifying. Oh my God. No. Blade spread eagle, bro. Like, he didn't get yeah. no Oh. Honey, <laughs> to the rescue. Oh. Ow. Oh. Ah. I wa what? Thank you, Sasha. <laughs> we gotta work together here. We're not. You said that a little too late. <laughs> Let's take a good picture. A good family picture. photo. Family photo. Yeah, family. Here it comes! God, I look happy. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Walkie's on. We don't even have the. Oh, shit! That's a bit. That's a bit. Sir, do you live here? Yeah. We're not blonde. We're blonde. Bro, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> I'm a little teapot. Um. You're my little teapot. You should have. You shouldn't have jumped off there, buddy. You're my <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Don't run away. Her name is Zoe. Come oh, here. Look at her. You I'm fucking rip her damn throat. Like, it, what it looks like you. It looks like you guys were like <laughs> freaking beating the hell out of this cat. That's what it looked like. Isn't it cute as fuck? Fucking adorable. Fucking love this cat. Fucking. Now, this indie title is being developed uh, and published by Hainier Studio, and I certainly hope I didn't butcher that too bad. Blight Survival is a beautiful looking zombie hack and slash that is set in an alternate medieval world. Now, I know it sounds weird to use the terms beautiful and zombie in the same sentence, but this game is visually on point. After watching this trailer through a few times, I really like how the lighting looks, the structures, the character designs, and of course, the blood and gore. Now onto my favorite part is the combat system. This game looks to like have a Souls-like combat system, but with its own flair. Now we can sneak up on opponents in the prone position or crouched with some really cool ways to execute the enemy. Now, as you can see in the trailer as well, we can hack and slash our way, as well as equipping a bow and arrow for ranged attacks. Now we can also see that looting will be pretty important in the game. We will be able to loot bodies of the fallen, as well as items that are just laying about the world. Now speaking of the world, the game takes place between two desperate kingdoms in war. Now there is a blight about the world that has erupted and rapidly spreads, turning man into monster. Now we will be tasked with venturing into the troublesome world and attempting to vanquish the blight and all that's caught up in it. Now another big bright spot for me guys is the game is a cooperative adventure that can be played with up to three other players. So be on the lookout for more information on Blast Survival, guys, as it doesn't have a release date just yet, but this one sure looks promising. I got it from behind while he's looking at you. Gross. You just did. I did my best work from back there. Gross. <laughs> Epic transition. Okay, right, guys, I want you all to introduce yourself one by one. Uh, Alex, you first. Hi, I'm Mr. Tastic, and you're watching Disney Channel. Yeah, a little voice break. Uh, then you go and paint, and then you make like a little Disney logo. Man, shut your bitch ass up. Tommy, introduce yourself. That's all right. Don't do Whoa. this. Uh, right, thanks for your introduction, Tommy. All right, Alfie, oh, you introduce sorry. yourself. Yo, what's up, there, guys? It's Alfie of Figure Freaking Today we're doing a Fortnite video. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and leave a little comment. <laughs> Tommy's so. adding some background music. And I'm Jakutsu. Welcome to Fortnite, bitches. <laughs> oh, I've got grenades. Grenades. Okay. Uh, why have I got C4? What's up, Juice? Because Tommy, why this is the explosive. This is like everything only. Huh? 
Yeah, I forgot we were playing the uh -oh. LTM. That's my bad. Uh -oh. My fault, OG. Oh my god, everyone's by me. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, god. So I'm we dead. back in. The oh. oh no. They just horashima to me. Horashima. Oh <laughs> <laughs> made me happy, made me smile. Nice. Oh, they're all down there! Ah! Oh my god, I killed someone! Oh, oh, oh. Wait, wait, oh, oh, no, no. He stuck me up there. Um. Oops, I stuck him again. Whoa. Yeah, that did nothing. Oh! Oh, did I get him? No, I didn't get him. Get him out of me! I'm trying to like predict him. I'm trying to predict his move. Oh no. Wait, I've got him. Oh no, I've got a good idea, Alfie. Oh god! Oh, he's got bombs! Oh, oh, fuck off, fuck off! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, I'm fucking terrified! Yes, I've got, I've got you thinking. Oh my god, this. this I am currently hitting the gritty for Ukraine. Is that, is that oh, shit. oh that's a that's a fucking statue. Oops, that's it. The other way. Feeding the cat. Mm. I got something else we could feed. Oh come on please, Daddy. <laughs> You be my Valentine for the time being. Fuck a fucking splint, do anything, do every fucking thing at the last fucking second. Hello. <laughs> so, I don't know what this game is. Um, I know you gotta do shit to, like, around the house, and it asks you if you did it. But other than that, I know fuck all. So, let's. Get into it. Let's fucking do her. Oh. Situation one, subject A. Go to bed. I don't wanna. Go to bed. I don't wanna. Go to bed. I don't wanna. Put. Okay. Home security system. Okay. Yo, what the fuck is this? Hello? Dude! Is that... What part of the Bronx are you in? You need a giant ass lock on the fucking door handle. What's this? Okay. Oh. Duh, you have to shut fucking lights off when you go to bed. And we can't. Hmm. Okay. Um, what? Did you lock the front door? Yes. Yo, what the fuck? Nah. Did you close the window? Yeah? On the home security system. Yeah. My fucking window. Did you hide the knives? Nah. That was an option. I went and looked at the fucking knives. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. Don't you dare. Don't. Don't fucking do it. Oh, I'm fucked. Already! Hi. Right. 
sure you feel. Someone got in. Thanks everybody that's involved with doing this. Um, I'm really excited for this to start. I'm really excited for this to happen. Um, this is such a good cause and I'm so glad with the people that are involved with this and, and joining in. I'm so glad that we as a community are working together on this to make this possible. Um, I want to thank you all so much. And uh, before I let you go, I'd like to announce that Leg is supporting us 100% with doing this. And I couldn't thank them enough. This is going to be such a huge thing, and I am so glad that Leg is joining behind us on this. I love you guys. Thank you for everything. The support, the the help that I've gotten from everybody with putting this together. Um, I, I truly couldn't thank you guys enough. So, thanks Leg. Thanks everybody included. And can't wait to see the magic that happens come September 1st. Thanks guys.